Hey guys, this is what if here. I wanted to just do a, a legitimate vlog where I actually do stuff instead of just sitting in front of a camera talking. So, I just uh, while I'm um, quite literally uh, putting uh, Coca Cola in my my fridge over there, um, I just wanted to explain how I will be doing career mode. Yes, career mode will be happening on NASCAR Heat Evolution. It's just like just way too easy. It felt like, but um. I do plan on doing. Uh, oh! Oh my god! Oh! 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 Ow! Oh my god! Ow! The Coca Cola! Oh, I opened up the can of Coca Cola right at the edge of my pad and it hit my foot and it all of them fell. Except for one. <laughs> Okay, that makes everything easier. Oh, there's a battery fell out of my pocket. Hey guys, this is What If Here, and as you just saw, that was the bloopers of me trying to vlog, and it turned out to be a freaking nightmare. Everything went wrong trying to do simple tasks while recording, so enjoy that little bit at the beginning. And um, obviously, I probably didn't explain it very well, depending on how I cut this. But I will be doing a NASCAR Heat Evolution career mode. It will be um, two seasons. Because I did, I did a practice uh, thing of it, and basically I can get a championship in two seasons, which is kind of crazy. And you can almost get damn near all of the upgrades in two seasons, which, um, that's... I don't, I don't even know. I honestly don't even know. But it is possible to win a championship that quick. And what I plan on doing is, like I said, two seasons. And the first season, it will be 7% race lengths with the cautions on because 7% is the, is the minimum for cautions. It's weird, I, I don't know, but that's what I'll be doing. And for the second season, it will be at 4% race length. And I might try to have at least two videos in there because the race lists are much shorter. By that time, I'll have next to near all of the basic equipment and upgrades to have my car at least competitive and I did practice things of it, and it just got to the point where it was just so, just, just meh at the end of it, that I, I don't want to hey, race any longer, because I was about to fall asleep, because it's, it's just, it's not very fun. Then once those two seasons are done, then I'll do championship mode. Now I'm going to be doing this a little bit different from the way uh, Real Radman's done it, because at this point he is like the, the, the surfacing god of the NASCAR community, like, He's just, he's rising up. And he, I want to say back on the street, but he's never, he was never off the street. He's rising up, okay? That's, that's to put it lightly. And that's a, this is a plug for him, because I, I like the content he does, alright? It's, it's hot. I would do his channel if it was a physical being. <laughs> um, but I will be doing it different for the way Rural Admin does it. What I, what I plan to do is... I don't know if I want to do 13% race length with 100, uh, 105 uh, AI difficulty or 25%. And this will be much longer, lengthier races with normal tire wear. And I will start last every race when I get to that. And um, the only tracks I would probably need like a legit like setup. And when I mean my setup, I mean just a mere wedge adjustment to make my car looser. It's probably at New Hampshire and was the other track <laughs> Phoenix New Hampshire and Phoenix are the two tracks where I do need to adjust the wedge I might do that for Dover when I get to it because Dover is a bit more harder than it than it should not not harder than it should but it is very difficult it is possible with uh, a default so, but I think um, that's if I don't that's if I qualify but since I'm not I probably will be using a default or a fucking setup for Dover. So really, basically six races out of the season, I will be using a quote-unquote setup, aka a, a, a mere simple wedge adjustment. So that's really it. And I'm only doing that just because that the car is so incredibly tight, and I, I just can't really gain any positions like that. And I don't think it'll be very a very entertaining video if I'm just in the back, probably all by myself for like the entire thing. It's I don't think that anybody wants to watch that. 
yeah, that's the general gist. Um, thank you everybody for being so damn patient. I can't even. I, I just, I just thank you so much. Without you guys, I wouldn't even exist on this channel or this platform as YouTube. So I have you to thank, and also I gotta thank uh, the people that actually uh, donated to me in the the fan funny thing. I I can't even believe uh, like the amount I got, and uh, since I don't know who uh, donated to me, I don't really I don't know. But whoever it was, if they're watching this or anything, thank you so damn much. Thanks for watching. I hope you stuck around to the end. I'll see you all later when NASCAR Heat Evolution LP starts up, and oh, and for career mode when I do do that i will be uh putting out hard difficulty which is the hardest difficulty for career mode yeah thanks for watching I'll see you all later i hope you're looking forward to it and as always have a good day everyone